fans and welcome to another episode of Mark's Modern Moments. Now today we're doing 75913 and that is the LEGO Speed Champions uh, F14T and Scuderia um, fight Ferrari truck. Uh, <laughs> that was a bit of a mouthful there I suppose. Uh, this is the largest set of the new LEGO uh, Speed Champions theme. Um, cost uh, 79.99. And uh, well, I think this is the coolest looking set of, of the lot. Just just by looking at the box uh, here, uh, you got a Ferrari uh, F1 car here. This actually goes inside, uh, and there's uh, other things in there as well, and also the cab. So you know, let's get inside here, and definitely let's see how this builds.
So what can we say about the F-14T and Scuderia Ferrari truck then? Um, well, there's a couple of words that come to mind, uh, namely wow and also stickers. Uh, lots and lots of stickers in this set, but we'll get through it all and I'll show you, you know, closer up in the uh, in the truck as well. Start off with the spare pieces here. Uh, I've put these uh, in bags, so this is uh, bag one. You get an extra visor, you get a, uh, an extra pair of head uh, sets, a uh, headset for there, uh, and some random pieces. Uh, bag two, you get uh, an extra couple of these taps, the, the blue and yellow, and another headset in there. Um, for bag three, just uh, extra pieces, Technic and uh, plates, really. And then bag four, just one spare piece in bag four, it's an extra gold round tile. Uh, bags five and six don't have any spare pieces, and then bag seven has a couple of Technic pieces and um, plates. A tile, shall I say. One instruction booklet with this set, which is a big shame, um, because, you know, there's seven numbered bags. Seven bags. They could have split up the book um, into two books, uh, considering that with the other Speed Champion sets, uh, the small cars have two books. Um, so why why is this all in one book? Um, seven bags, one book. You can't really split it up if there's multiple people that want to build this at the same time. Uh, so that is a big shame there. I said before, there's a lot of stickers in here. Yes, there are 53 stickers across two sticker sheets. Um, a whole lot of amount of stickers and there are some very small ones um, to go on the car. Not, not too much fun. Uh, with stickers on this one uh, a lot of, there's some big ones as well a couple of big ones and a couple of long ones but trying to get all these um, in there and online and everything like that not so much fun with the stickers on this on this set at all could have done with especially the really small ones being uh, printed bricks so let's talk about the minifigures then um, got six minifigures in this set um, all, all for different jobs uh, we'll start off with this guy. He he has got a uh, a printed torso. Uh, they most of them have the same torso. It's just the driver of the car that's uh, slightly different. We'll zoom in just a little bit more there. And uh, this guy's got the radio, uh, single print face, and uh, a headset. And the second second one. Oh, not him over. Second guy, as you can see different face same torso same printed torso front and back uh, with some cool logos on there and red gloves and another headset now we've got the uh, the the female of the group she's uh, got the computer for the lap times and that single print face and a nice ponytailed hair piece there and the uh, same torso again now we've got the guy for the um the pit crew this guy's got some uh some shades on another headset uh, and the stop sign here uh this is uh one of the stickers same torso front and back printing and then i'm going to pull this guy up with his scooter as well because you do get this nice little uh ferrari red scooter um he's got a blue helmet and he's got he's got a slight bit of stubble there on his face uh blue helmet slightly tinted visor and this, the scooter is pretty cool as well. It's got nice uh, thin wheels, and uh, this is the stand that you so it doesn't fall over. And uh, a nice little thing there, you can put a bit, a couple of items on there, um, so you can carry them around. And then the final minifigure in this set, he's got a different torso to the other guys. This has got more. This has got extra printing for the uh, the the logos, and that you got the shell, you got Ferrari, you got Santander, and. What is that other one? UPS. And the UPS there as well. And it's a different back printing on this. It just says Ferrari on there. This is uh, seems to be the most plainest face of the lot. But he does have a silver helmet and a slightly tinted visor. Other accessories you get in this set are, you know, the um, the wheeled dolly there. So uh, you can put a tyre on there and uh, wheel it around. And uh, then we've got the tool chests. So now this one's got... The cross spanner on it and uh, inside you put in the drill and the oil can um, pretty cool how they've done this it looks like casters and wheels these are just hinges that are from from other stuff so uh, great great thinking there from Lego and then the other tool chest in on the side you've got the uh, the ratchet 
and then inside is the whole rest of the, the tools in there. You get a full selection of tools, uh, ring spanners, open spanners, wrenches, uh, hammers, and a screwdriver. This car is, uh, well, if it was uh, one of the other videos I've done this week, this would be the main star of the show. Uh, the car, really nicely detailed. Um, the shape of this is, is really good. I mean, a lot of it is the same as the um, McLaren, uh, but... There are some differences. The back end is different uh, from from here, and uh, the front is definitely uh, very different. Um, but this is where the most of the fiddly little stickers are on. Now, for, unfortunately, I did get one of these pretty wrong, and it's this one on the side, just here. That that one's pretty, just just slightly off, and it is annoying. The, the fiddly ones, they're the ones that need to be printed bricks. Seriously, do. Um, but you've got a couple on the side here, and on here, and one on the back, and all the front section, every detail is pretty much a sticker. There's, um, I think there's only a couple of printed bricks in here, um, and only one that I can think of. The rest are stickers, which is a big shame. But other than that, you know, uh, it is cool, because you can take the front off, and you've got two different fronts. For this, I'll just pull this one off. The... Uh, the truck here which I will get to so two different fronts for the car slightly different one with stickers one without different designs and this does just clip on there as well well now let's get to the main part of this build uh, absolutely fantastic truck here couple of things that are slightly wrong with it but apart from that I mean overall this is a really good truck it's nicely solidly built it's got room for everything in there it's even got a uh, play space in there it's not it doesn't feel cramped in you know when you put stuff in there it's got a space it doesn't feel cramped in so I'll start putting this thing these things in there you put the tool chests these go on the side just like so and they clip in on a couple of studs and uh, so there the tool chest goes there and the scooter that just locks into place there into that little bay so that's that's pretty cool so the front side of that is storage for your for your stuff uh on the on the end of here you've got a couple of checkered flags and there's a, a winner's trophy there uh on the top this is where you store your spare you've got your spare wing just at the top and it just pokes in and then you've got your spare wheels two spare wheels and tires that just slot onto the top great design great thinking of uh, how to use the space so it's really good. Um, we'll get this uh, the dolly in as well. Um, this does slot in. I did have it in there before. Oh, wait. Um, there we go. That's in there. So that slots in there. Well, so there you go. And that's all your stuff sorted out, stored in there. And just to close this, it just folds down. The car at the back here, this just rides up the ramp. Like so, and then you pull the tailgate up, and it's a folding hinge tailgate, and that just slots in a position. Then you can just close that lid there. So this this truck separates. Uh, there's a lever on this side that that pulls some uh, some feet out at the bottom, and then you just lift it up, pull that out, and the uh, the trailer doesn't uh, fall over because it's got the feet out. And uh, this is the part that there's something slightly wrong with just the cab and all it is is that uh, the roof comes off pretty easily it's not held on by much there's one stud in the center here there's a couple of studs at the side but nothing really holds this on uh, very well um it's got the as you can see it's got ferrari.com at the at the front there but there is enough room here um to uh, put the radio in the back and you sit sit one guy in there and then you can get the driver and get him in there as well and it, there is a bit of space there to put some stuff and uh, but and uh well you know that that just goes straight back on once you've finished all that put the uh where the windscreen would go into place again and you know it is a, it is a really cool um cab with you know full stickers at the front all stickers here stickers and uh, more stickers on the side and it's even detailed around the back of the actual cab uh, with the vents here before we finish i'll just show you a couple of extra things this does nicely back up onto here it locks itself into position you use the lever pull the feet up and you're away and also if i just move this book 
out of the way a little bit. I'll pull this forward. In inside here, there's a little bit of an action button in here. Pull the ramp down. And if I can just get to the uh, to the button, just push this uh, with a bit of force, and the car comes straight out. Uh, ready to go so pretty cool well thank you for watching this episode i know it's been quite a long one uh, the rest of the week's been uh shorter than this uh, so if you've got to this point then thank you very much um please do remember if you have enjoyed this video then please do remember to like share and uh, subscribe to the channel uh again all and all comments are really appreciated links to this set and other parts of the channel are in the description box uh, just below the video and we'll uh, see you guys on the next model moment good day mm -hmm.